Airbnb is cracking down on rowdy parties right here in Las Vegas. And the company, this sounds familiar, they're once again planning to block customers with bad reviews from renting out their properties during big holiday weekends. Yeah, it's all pretty timely with New Year's less than three weeks away. Also Christmas parties, mm -hmm. that can be big as well. We also know hundreds of thousands of people are expected to come to town. Yes, so we have reporter Alyssa Bethencourt joining us live now on the strip to explain how this ban will work exactly. Alyssa, good morning. Hey there, Kalina. Good morning to you. Look, Airbnb wants to keep the parties here on the strip and out of your neighborhood. Last year, they tried this same strategy on New Year's, and they were able to stop nearly 1,500 people from booking on their website. So the plan this year is to block one night reservations for people with negative reviews on their platform or people with no reviews at all. This will prevent them from booking home listings in Las Vegas or anywhere else in the country. Airbnb says parties on their properties haven't been allowed since the summer of 2020. But of course, there's always a few people who try to break the rules. It's one thing to have a policy. It's another to you know, do our very best to enforce that policy and to uh, acknowledge the reality that there are always going to be people out there who don't care about that rule and who try to break that rule. Um, so they're throwing that party without the knowledge, without the consent of that local Airbnb host, and that's a big problem. That's not something we we would allow, um, and, and we're kind of pulling out all the stops to try to stop that. Right, so Airbnb says anybody who tries to go against their new policy could be suspended or possibly even permanently removed from their platform. For now, reporting live on the Las Vegas Strip, I'm Elizabeth in court.